So the power of SHE is, um, the SHE stands for Shaping and Honing Entrepreneurs, and it's an entrepreneurial incubator for women of color. And um, for myself, I've been an entrepreneur for over 20 years, and here in Sacramento, um, just trying to navigate the resources that are available to entrepreneurs, startups, um, as it pertains specifically to women of color and addresses the needs of women of color was always a really um, significant challenge. I started Willow Tree Roots, which is the parent organization. We um, have projects in Kenya, Peru, Nepal. I looked around one day and realized that I wasn't doing my part for my own community, um, especially understanding the struggles that women of color entrepreneurs have in just finding resources, getting started, getting funding, and navigating spaces um, with a specific sensitivity toward being a woman of color in business. Um, and so we started the, the Power of She to address those those um, needs in the community. And my business is Laura Gardet Cosmetics. I went to a pitch, the pitch competition for the Power of She, and I was just in the audience because I love to hear people pitch. It's, I love to see the passion that people have when they talk about their passion in general. This is a pitch competition, and it's a part of a larger incubator program. For my business, um, it is a tour company called Capital Tuk Tuk. Yes, um, we'll be launching here pretty soon. It is a touring company for Sacramento specifically because the city is growing. I think there's a real need for it right now. I applied and was accepted to the first cohort. My business and the one that I went through the power of she with is pop schools and we're creating collaborative learning spaces for kids in co-working spaces. Um, with a focus on technology, entrepreneurship, and the arts. My business is called Swagger House of Art and Fashion, and what it will entail is a exclusive um, boutique, which will also have a workspace for creatives, like fashion designers and jewelry makers, as well as give opportunities for um, fashion students that need internship um, opportunities. And I am the owner of Gemini Gems Event Planning and Advising. The Power of She did an application process I went to the link I filled out the form and I just kind of kept my fingers crossed for a good opportunity <laughs> and my business name is Joe May design so it's a family business I mean I tell people my bags are conversation starter but the power of she is a conversation a conversation starter that's led me to be able to just realize my dream and what I want to do with this business. My business is Michael and Mill Bridal Coordinators and what I do is I help out the bride that either can't afford a wedding planner or the bride who is a control freak and actually doesn't realize that she can't coordinate her wedding and actually be in it. So my business which is called Valley Pie is actually um, a publishing business and we focus um, more so on, it's a writing service, but we focus on publishing children's books. I learned about the power of she from actually Sacramento Sister Circle. Uh, Healing Grace Studios um, actually was founded prior to joining the power of she. So I did have um, experience uh, with business and jump starting my business, um, but some of the skills necessary to keep my business going, I was able to learn through the power of she. We are gonna be starting our new cohort in February. Yeah, That's the goal, is to do one at the beginning of the year and one at the end of the year. Opening up applications starting next week. If you are or know of a woman entrepreneur in the Sacramento area that could benefit from an entrepreneurial incubator, please have, have her apply.